the question now is, what do we do next? Good question. Yeah, I'd pretty much be doing what you're doing right now, just running around uh, looking for anything. Maybe get back to the central hub. What about going back to sleep in the bed and come around here in the dark? I can't. It's blocked off at night time. Ah, uh, okay. Well, there you go then. Where do these take me? I see they're they're all on the lock now. Um. All right, let's go up here. I wonder what's up here. Yeah, that's the boss fight area. After she tried to murder me last time. That was the GLaDOS area. So what about the sword? Who's the sword? Oh, she's here again. <laughs> okay. Yeah, this is what you need to do. Where that dash comes in handy. Ouch, how do you get out of that? Um, short answer is you don't. Yeah, because uh, you had three kind of almost concentric waves coming in at the same time and you can't jump. Ooh, okay. Ouch, you got All your right. ass handed to you. Uh, not, it's not too bad. It's not, it's not too bad. Um, <laughs> uh, maybe I saw a different match than you did. Because <laughs> uh, the health was barely taken down. Like, it was over a quarter. Um, yeah. You're dead at a quarter health? Yeah, I don't think that's, that's not a good sign in my book. Mate, we, we didn't even knock any health off for the first time. So. Oh, okay. Well, then that that is uh, much better. All right, let's try yeah. the. That, I haven't seen uh, that boss before. Aura's gem. Oh, we haven't got that one. I thought we had. How about, how about the, the no health? Uh, oh yeah, um, yeah, yeah, yeah. What, what what's the worst that could happen there? Let's go for the cyan peril ring, which I'm wondering if that gives me an increase in defense. I don't know if we maybe need the bracer as well. Well, that light was outside, but it's the moon. <laughs> and ready, set, die. Thanks for your confidence, man. <laughs> It's appreciated. Yeah, I try my best. Did it? Quarter health Ouch. already. Ooh, wow.
Okay. Jeez. Holy crap. That, that was definitely powerful, but man, does that use up your magic. Decent, decent damage. Almost down to third quarter damage. And that dash has saved your ass. Ooh, less than a quarter left. Got it. You got it. Got to it. Told you it wasn't that bad. Told you. Uh, but I'm, <laughs> I'm not being funny. I think there's going to be a second phase because the. Uh, that's what it looks the like. The bar hasn't uh, gone off the screen. Oh dear. Recharging, recharging, and wow, you gotta do it twice. Oh my god! Oh my god! Holy snipes! Oh snap! Okay. Well, yep. Uh, you can take it all back. You got your ass handed to you. Because, because technically, uh, you only got a third of the way through. Because the reason why I say a third is because I'm assuming that oh, don't assume. when you don't beat her assume. the second time, that's the end of it. But the reason why I say a third is because that second half is much harder than the first half. So the first half is kind of like a third of. Yeah, yeah, I see, I, see, I see what you're saying. Because, <laughs> wow. Yeah, I would have just thrown my controller. <laughs> I knew, though, like, the, the fact that the health bar didn't go off the screen instantly said to me, this fight is going to a second phase. Yeah, well, the fact that uh, that... that Wow, stayed on the screen and the whole lighting and stuff said re-energizing. Yeah, that was... That's the first boss that did that. That I'm aware of. Yeah. So, yeah. Boss fights are not getting any easier. That's for sure. <laughs> buy them all that's uh magic right yeah yeah two thousand yeah the, I, i'd say that shotgun blast uh magic thing was very 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 effective yeah, now interestingly, what I noticed, and you probably noticed as well, there was times in that battle where she almost um, was taking a rest. You can almost, like, stagger her, which was quite interesting. She kind yeah, of, like, when you attacked her with the shotgun thing, I mean, it absolutely drained her health quick. That's what got... That's, that was like 90% of what killed her, or killed the first. Yeah, the know, first phase. I mean. Yeah. Because I mean, at Ramsey, you were at like uh, around a quarter-ish damage done, and you took her down to less than a quarter health left when you used that.
How do I get yeah, down if here? Yeah, if you just had enough to, to use that for two rounds. Yeah, you know I mean, I had three. I had three on that, that occasion, three magic pots to use, whereas now I've got like nine, a few more. I've got 14. <laughs> Yeah, how many? The only thing I've, the only thing you got to be wary of is that it just, it seems to take an extremely long time to pull out your potion and like regen your health. So you really need to put a, like a bit of distance between you and her to be able to regen your health. Really want to find out how to get to this chest. Yeah, that, that, there's got to be something good in that one. And I think that that chest would give me something that'll make it easier to beat that uh, boss. That chest gives you jumping ability, but you have to have the jumping ability to get to the chest. I think. <laughs> what a conundrum. And this is just a hunch. I think it's something to do with this. There's a couple of these dotted around. And I think there's probably some sort of code you can enter in front of these. I guess you've done the little musical spinning thing. Yeah, I've done that. I've entered the Konami code from the manual. Um, this one. Hmm. Enter it, enter it backwards. All right, so, uh, so I'm not, not that I'm ignoring what you just said. I will try that in a moment. Just looking at this page here, this is like called the fairy. I know like we're missing page 48 here, which is like the second page of it. But um, what do you get from looking at that picture? You're on the same wavelength as me here. Uh, yeah, I wasn't really paying attention when you were flipping back and forth. Could you? Now this at... this this page here that I'm on now, it's um. Uh, well, uh, I mean, uh, just a picture itself looks like, you know, waterfall behind a waterfall yeah. place to go. Yeah. Uh, exactly. Uh, got the. The uh, Trezzler chest, and then that magic thing, and you get a seeking spell. Yeah, so this thing here is the fairy. We've already, we've already released the fairy. Uh, okay. We just so what need about to the find seeking where it spell? went to. No, we haven't found that yet. I think I think the seeking spell. That sounds like something that would work really well against that uh boss like uh obviously uses magic but then it i, I assume seeking like it, it it follows and and hits it no matter where it goes kind of thing maybe i don't know i am clueless all right well, i think the plan at the minute is to find waterfalls and don't go chasing them there see if we can uh sorry I'll, I'll stick to the rivers and the lakes that i'm used to yeah
I'll be right back to no memento, for favor. Okay. Have these little things been giving you a little trouble? Yeah, they sent me on fire. Which I don't health, like. Your health is a bit low. Yeah, they keep setting me on fire, which, you know, like I say, I don't think it's very fair. Yeah, that's being, being on fire is not typically a healthy thing for a mammal. Unless it's not you and you're wanting to eat it, as us omnivores do. Pointless that you can't get up there, but okay. Fire, fire. Okay, I'll fire. one of those weapons in real life. Well, where you can just like zip around. Oh gun. no. Uh, about the, the, gun? The, the shotgun kind of weapon. Because it's, it's actually more badass than an actual shotgun. But also, yeah, if I could, if I could travel around like that, I'll, I'll take that too. Because that would be uh, pretty kick butt. I would be an Olympic champion. Nobody could touch me. I could I could beat Michael Phelps records, no problem. Because I could use it in the water. And I'd also uh, beat uh, Usain Bolt. Make him look like he was the slowest person on earth. It's 
So you're saying you would use it for your personal advantage? <laughs> but of course. For for nothing but monetary gain and power. And then I would uh, buy what's left of Russia, change the name, and turn it into a democracy. And share all of its wealth of the land, oil, and everything with, with the whole planet. So, see, not completely selfish. Not completely selfish, no. Just partially. You gotta take care of yourself first before you take care of other people. Tell me I'm wrong. Uh, you are not wrong. It's like the safety announcement on the, uh, the airplanes, isn't it? Make sure you uh, deal with yourself first before helping other people. In the event yeah, of the that's right. Like, like put it on your oxygen mask. Yeah, I mean, it's true there. I mean, if somebody else can't, you can take care of yourself. Otherwise, it's two people down or more as opposed to just one. Yeah, but I, I mean, I hopefully, you know, I'm never in that sort of situation. But the way I always look at it, there, it's like, well, I'd put my kids first so I'd get my kids. I'd make sure my kids were sorted before me, but... That's, just so that's what they're that's what you're telling you if you try to do that and and then you pass out now you're out of the game and they're out of the game so to speak of course you know it's it's a general rule not a it depends on the situation but yeah, they're, they're, I think they're basically just telling people that because it's it's the safest bet in general. Ooh. But because so many people just don't have common sense. You know, like, like you know if you're in trouble or not at that moment. If you were able to, you know, like go ahead and get their mask on kind of thing. Uh, when the cabin de depressurizes and, uh, and then you're, you're fine to get yours on the last and sure. What is this? Yeah, this looks interesting. Been here. Yeah, there's a big waterfall. It's a shame you can't see anything. Well, the guy around that has the light. I think I'm above this. You can't get over there? Yeah, you're above it. Yeah, you're definitely like about uh, I'd say if you look at the squares on that chessboard he's walking on, you, you're about four and a half, four of those up. Yeah. Hmm. Oh, uh, hit the less suckage button, it says. Left and right. So I guess when you hit the left suckage or left suckage button, you suck less. So if you get left Apparently right. so. <laughs> All right. Well, well uh, it looks like there's. Is that a ramp on? bottom side going to that area it's, it's almost like you're on 
different plane. I mean, like you're walking against what leads you up to that test board. Just, I mean, obviously, there's got to be a way for you to get to him. It's a seven by six board, too, so it's not even a. Even six though it looks like a chess board, it's not an eight six. by eight. Six by six, not seven by six. Yeah, uh, yeah, it is six. It just looked awkward. I, did, I see the light now. Thought it was six by six, and then I was like, no, it looks like it's longer that way. So it's just a miniature chessboard. Yeah, third. Well, that worked, but can you get the coins? <laughs> I'll take that as a no. And you get rid of the light. That was admitted for the fight. Yeah. There's something, there's something here though. But it's how do you get there? And where else does that lead? That's my question. Yeah, um... Hmm. See, that would sort of... In, it kind of felt like we, we said, like, we're, we're too high. Yeah, pick her up above it, but you can't fall down. Drop down. But yeah, and there must be another way to get there besides. Uh, must be a, you know. Yeah, definitely. A, a, just a different direction to come in to where you end up there. That like that direction was just to show you that it's there. I don't know of like any. I mean, I'm sure there is, but I, I can't think of any underground passages in the vicinity. Yeah, I have no clue, but it, that there's got to be a way to get there. Uh, I would think. And and that would also lead to uh, going somewhere else new. Possibly. Yeah. Agreed. And we need to go into the... Um dark cave again. There's something there. Uh, 
Okay. We use our Konami code here. No. That looks just like the door on the book. Okay, I think I know how to open them. What did you do? I looked at the pattern on the door and I pressed the direction starting at the dot. Ah, uh, say so the dot. Right up, left up, right down, kind of thing. Yeah. And that's what it's showing there, I guess. Yeah, those are arrows. Up, right down, left down, left down, left down, left up. Wow. That's something with the spell that we've not yet found. That's got to be a, a mega spell. <laughs> that feels like a big one. Looks like a shield and knife and the apothecary equals a flying shield and... Yeah, well, that looks like it's, it's like the magic... The magic rod in the middle, the grappling hook thing on the right, and then I don't know, sword and shield. I mean, that's what it looks like. And this is something about the windmill. Yeah, and there's almost like it's indicating like the sails indicate which way to press. Yeah. There's a show on, on the, the the blades themselves, they're all going clockwise. Yeah. But then uh, there's a pattern on each of the blade with the left down, right up on the right side to... Look for uh, there's a circle at the bot on the bottom one that it's pointing to. Uh, let's go and have a look at the uh, windmill. Yeah, it's definitely because it's it's that oh. that's a what? Hey, another one. I, I came here before, and I think this is obviously the I think this is where the things come, the collectibles come. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. I came here and like just saw all these plinth and podiums before, but um, wow. Okay. okay. At least but, yeah, if you look at now. that picture again, it's showing the bottom one, and the and the zoom out part is uh, from the bottom one, and it's showing that it it has a symbol and a direction. Uh, yeah, I'd say that would be the place to go. Well, windmill's just above us, so we'll have to check that out in a minute. Uh, also, actually, before I do that. Go over here. Down here. I want to check this theory again here. There's a lot more ups, down, left, and right. Yep. Nailed it. Yeah, once you said that the first time, I was like, yeah, that's good. that's definitely it. Nailed it. Rainbow chest. Mr. Mayor. Uh, okay, that's going to be back in that room now. Yeah, yeah. He looks a bit like the Pringles guy with yeah, cho chopsticks for legs. <laughs> it, it reminds me, well, one, the Pringles guy... And 
Uh, I'll say Monopoly for some reason. Yeah, yeah. They, to be fair, they are pretty similar. Okay, well, that's cool. All right, well, we now know what to do with these symbols whenever we yep. come across them. Very nice. I was kind of hoping that was going to give me a path, though, to yeah, that treasure yeah. chest there. I <laughs> know. Right? I mean... Okay, windmill. Any of them have any sign? Oh! See the little slits? So I'm thinking... Each, each of the sails has an arrow on the... The slits are arrows. So I'm thinking as they get to the bottom... And then you hit them then. Oh, that one's tied off. See that? Yeah. Why is that one tied to the other one? That that can't be, that's not coincidence. All right, let's look at this again. Yeah, the bottom one, we're showing the the outside going to the inside one on the bottom right. Inside to inside, inside to inside, the rest of the way. Okay, so you start, we need to find the start point. Okay. But then you go around the outside and then you cut into the inside and yeah. do the inside afterwards. Which is, I think that's what the string is for. So you start with the first one and then you have to do you start with that one because you know you know when to go inside once you get back around to the uh your starting point yeah so and this one get... first yeah oh no wait this one first this one's first so yeah, down so... left right left, up what up uh i'm seeing right. it different Right, left, down, right, up, down. Do anything. You, yeah, I was seeing it different. You're you're looking on which side the thing is ripped. Yeah, I'm that's... look. I'm I'm looking at them like arrows themselves. Yeah, no, yeah, it's which, whichever down, way the... Right, yeah, okay, I see what you're... Yeah, yeah, yeah. on the right-hand side, yeah, okay. It's whatever side they're on. Okay. I think maybe what I'll do, instead of, like... Yeah, you're right, instead you're of, right. Instead of inputting them, let me get my notepad, and I'll make a note of what they actually are. Maybe you have to kind of input them relatively so quickly. But say the uh, the picture, the windmill on the picture is going clockwise, whereas the windmill in your reality is going counterclockwise. No, I, I don't think it's going clockwise. I think it's just telling you the order to how to read it. So you start at that one, you go all the way around the outside, then you cut to the inside. I think I think it's more just d d telling you the order more than anything else but. yeah i mean it's it's definitely telling you to go around so, okay, so i think you, i think you should start with the first one that left. the line's connected to you left. not the second one up 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 right right then we cut in the middle to right right left, left down oh, right up, down. And that's it. Yeah, well, down was the original. All right, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Right, so let's just check this again. So I got down, left, left, up, up. Right, 
Right, left, down, right, up, down. All right, so what? Okay, what about if you started with the... Good. That was magical. <laughs> <laughs> Sacred Geometry, a.k.a. the Triforce. Okay, now you got three in your throne room. Nicely done. Yeah. I feel like that should be worth more than just a trophy. Mm, possibly. I mean, maybe, like, if you get them all, then something extra special happens. <laughs> All right, so. But GG, man. Good job. So, thinking about things again here, we got the well. Is there. I wonder if there's a secret entrance somewhere here. It'll take us to the chessboard. Oh, the secret chest. Nice. Hey, keep finding stuff. That's always a bonus. Yep. Let's pull up the map of the well. Um. Hey, are we? You haven't missed uh, much at all. Uh, <laughs> just going to run a quick add to sex. All right, so oh. let's see whether or not we can. Find any more secrets. Oh, there's a chest up there that we haven't yet found. Hey, stuff. not take a dive off the bridge. Well, that would not be healthy for you, apparently. Man, those look like, uh, uh, gummy worms. Those monsters are pretty badass. Now oh, you don't mess with Manessi. I feel like, and we haven't found anything yet, so it's only speculation. I feel like that is part of something bigger. Those tentacles. Yeah, it does seem like that. Because every time I, like, destroyed one there, there was, like, a distant Another. groaning. There was a distant groaning as well. Yeah, like it's another boss. Yeah, I mean, I, I saw this down here. Like, do you see, like, those, like, spikes in the water? Yeah. Just right there. I, th I thought that was maybe something, but it appears not. Or at least not yet, but... Oh, yeah.
Boom. Locker, locker. Interesting shadow there in the water. Cathead. Uh, the piggy bank stuff. Wish. It looked like instead of the raccoon hats like Davy Crockett would wear their little cat hats. <laughs> Just a cat head with a tail. <laughs> Uh, piggy banks are money you can't lose. But that's a good thing. That would suck to find like a secret area that, that's a piggy bank and you could just lose it. Uh, I don't think I checked it in that whole way, I'll be no. Oh, hi, secret. Ooh. Oh, hello. Hi, Peck. Hello there, cat. Cat power. <laughs> That's what I'm calling it. Can't change my mind. Oh, that's what I, I was like. What's what is that like flashing away in the distance? But it's um, something to grapple onto. I assume this is the same then. Yeah. Okay, but we didn't find a way to. We didn't find a way to get to that chest. Yeah, chest. want to get to that chest. Want to see what's in that chest. Must get to a chest. Yeah, there was a bug earlier where he almost got stuck out by a cliff water area and almost couldn't get back. No. Oh, nice coin. Finding all the secrets. We have found so much tonight from just like walking around exploring and stuff. Oh, we've uh, we've uncovered some secrets, LB. You, you've missed yeah, some. Yeah, except for that one goddamn chest. Yeah. <laughs> That's, that's the one that bugs the shit out of me. Just watching, it's like, how can you get to it? And yeah, it's cool to keep finding all these others and secrets and stuff, but it's like, dude, how do you get to the chat? It's right there. I got all these tools. I got all these, I got grappling, I got that, I got all this stuff, but I can't just go there. Yeah. Whisper it in my ear, I'll be. Let, 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 let me hear the hint. I won't tell.
Does LB even know what chests we're talking about, though? There's a couple of chests. There's one in that last area we was in. And then, of course, there's the one that we've talked about a lot tonight, yep. uh, Deathwish. There's two and, different And then chests. there's the... The six by six chessboard area. Yeah, but I'm I'm convinced that we need to find another entrance to that. Hey crazy. What's up, crazy on? attack? I remember back in the earlier stages when you didn't have a light. And it made this this kind we of just, area a little more difficult. We just randomly <laughs> walked into here and was like, okay, what do we do now? <laughs> Die. <laughs> there's, there's something else in, of interest here, though. Um... On the map, if I remember rightly, it says something about this statue here. But on there, look, there's like a marking on that statue. Almost to indicate that there's... There's the X and an O on the floor marking, and then three X's. Yeah, now... Another X is marking where to be or where something is. I don't know. It's a pathway behind. It was oh, okay. No, nope. it's all right. LB's got us. Got our back. LB's got a better memory than us. Ah, well, that's easy to do. <laughs> we are. I would agree. It's it's not it's not difficult. Yeah, I have. Uh, I have. A, as much as you say you have a bad memory, I, I guarantee you, mine's worse. That's why. I, Terrible at playing games now, they require memory. And that's it's really gone downhill in the last five years, like between my early 40s and now my late, I'll, I'll be 50 in February. Yeah. And that's, and that's with trying to keep my mind sharp by playing puzzle games and all that kind of stuff. I don't think yeah. I'm doing myself a disservice, but wow. <laughs> uh, my memory is not like it used to be. I used to have a really good memory. All right, I need to try and figure out then. A couple of things. Gotta get that chest. Damn it, I wanna see that happen. The hell is that? <laughs> it, it, it's it's like a it's like a shark sticking its head up out of the water, kind of. Yeah, that's that's what happens when you like walk against the edge of the waterfall. <laughs> <laughs> you get a water dildo. <laughs> Alright, so there's there's something on the other side here. But I don't know what. Oh, is it just in Really? That's Okay, that's a bit um That's a bit weird, I guess. The question mark to me. 
almost in the case like something on the other side of the waterfall, but no, I, I see, I see it, I see. It. 